Hi everyone and welcome to today's video. Today I am doing a very quick uh, little intro video uh, to the inks from Standard, Standard Bindery. Now Standard Bindery is a retailer here in Australia. They have a physical store uh, in Queensland uh, as well as being a major online retailer of stationery products, fountain pens, inks, the like. They have a great range of stuff and uh, their prices are really well uh, matched to the Australian market. Now, Standard Bindery uh, used to be Bookbinders Online, uh, and as Bookbinders Online originally had a range of inks, which were really wonderful. I reviewed a couple early on and think they were fabulous. Uh, they stopped producing the inks and then a couple of years later, um, rebranded as Standard Bindery and uh, have started producing their own products once again. So there's notebooks, there's uh, cards and envelopes, things like that, which I've also reviewed a number of on this channel. And now they have uh, a range of inks. Now, I started with six, uh, and I have two here today. So I have this one, which is Road Trip and Clear Seas. Um, I think there are, of all the six, I think there are great, great colours there. Um, I uh, will be getting a couple more. I really like Old Friend and Lunar Tone, if you want to check those out as well. Uh, but the two I have here, which were sent to me by Standard Bindery, uh, Road Trip and Clear Seas. So this is how they come packaged. And it's a nice sort of craft card uh, box. They do a lot of this stuff in house. That's part of their uh, their product range. Is that as much as as much as possible is done in house. Um, and you just open it up, and you get a really lovely simple bottle. So it's got these lovely rounded corners, which I quite like. It's a sixty mil bottle, um, and uh, you know it's a decent sort of size. It's got a good opening on it, which I like as well. Most pens will fit in there without any problem. Um, so yeah, it's a really lovely range. Now, they are selling these internationally through other retailers. Uh, I think there are a few stores that have uh, picked up um, the, the range, which is brilliant. Um, so you can check them out at other places. I will link to Standard Binary here simply because uh, that is the, the brand as well. Uh, but check them out at other retailers. If you, know, there's, if you like the look of these inks, um, then yeah, they're worth looking at. So I'm going to just uh, show it on a few different papers now. Firstly, I've, I've pre-swabbed because they take a little bit of time to dry, uh, but this is it on Rodeo paper. Uh, and I have these inked into two pens. So I have the clear seas here in my, oh, there goes that little snake clip, roll stop thing. Um, my Fuller Wen double, uh, zero one seven. So we have here, this is is clear seas. Now this is Rhodia 80 gram paper. Um, the inks have a lovely flow to them and they shade really, really well. Um, and you know, they're, they're pretty wet. Um, I think there's probably, you know, a, a sort of a nice sort of, yeah, there is definitely a nice wetness to the inks here. Um, you can see there that the it's a nicely shading. The darker shades of this really do stand out, and the lighter shades are quite beautiful. There on the swab, you see a lovely range of it. So the clear seas is a sort of a, what I would consider a light blue turquoise, but it's got these beautiful, beautiful hints of green. Really, really gorgeous uh, that come through there. And then the second thing I have is Road Trip, which I have here in a Diplomat Excellence um, A2. Uh, both of these are medium nibs. So this is the standard. Bindery Road Trip. Once again, beautiful flowing ink. It's definitely not a dry ink at all. And this pen's not super wet, uh, dry either, mind you. But you see there's a lovely, a lovely sort of wetness and flow to that ink, which allows, once again, for that beautiful shading and uh, that beautiful, uh, you know, sort of dark little hints of the colour to sh show through and those beautiful bright blue, uh, bright green hits of it as well, which are really nice. And I think I might have gone off camera before, I'm very sorry, uh, but that's where it is. Um, so yeah, lovely, lovely colours. Let's look at it on a couple of other papers now. First, I have it here on Tomal River because Tomal River is sort of like the standard. Um, so we've got clear seas and road trip. You can see the green really coming through uh, on clear seas there. Uh, and some of that beautiful dark green halo shading there on road trip, which is just beautiful. 
Then lastly, I just put on another paper, a sort of a more absorbent paper, and this is the paper that my goals uh, in this, the Australian notebook brand, planner brand, use. So Clear Seas and uh, Road Trip. Uh, once again, the, the shading is less apparent on this paper because the paper is so sort of absorbent, um, but you see lovely sort of hints of that lighter shading there, but a real lovely depth to the colours, which I really quite like on this ink. So this was just a very quick first introduction to these two new inks from Standard Bindery. Um, hopefully they will produce um, more inks, uh, more colours as their brand develops. Um, I'm going to be looking at these two in more detail uh, coming up in the next you know, uh, month or so. Uh, and I will also try and get my hands on a few more but as a first introduction i think these are really lovely i think they shade beautifully i think the colors are great i love really love the packaging i think the price is about right uh, 60 mils in australia for just over 20 dollars is pretty great you know really um and so and they're good inks they perform i'll just have a quick look on the reverse of this page um just so you can see that like there's no you know there's no feathering or bleed or anything like that they uh oh sorry just bumped the camera um they yeah they perform well they hold up to you know this and very happy standard bindery inks um lovely brand and lovely store great customer service so check them out hope you found this video interesting and useful if you did give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel hit the notifications button if you want to stay up to date with the videos that i produce please feel free to get in touch using any of the platforms listed below you can find me on instagram or twitter at the underscore offstage underscore me or you can contact me on any of my videos here um if there's products you'd like to, you think I should be looking at, or there's a way I'd like to support the channel, uh, get in touch and let's see what we can do. In the meantime, enjoy your inks, enjoy your writing, and I'll talk to you later.